When I was in Iran in August, uh, Mr. Karimi and Mr. Uh, Muhammad Purabullah kindly came on one day. I mean, um, they came from Raj to Tehran and they arrived in the afternoon and uh, Zia arranged everything. So we went to the Time Museum Cafe and they kind kindly interviewed me. Here you just see some parts of the interview, it's not long. I mean, um, and uh, they interviewed me about my research, about my books, and what I have written. I would like uh, really to thank Mr. Burabullah and also Mr. Karim for their support. And uh, also what, uh, um, I mean, they just, uh, Mr. Karim bought all my books and has been a long time supporter of my research. And um, they established a cafe a museum in Rasht. Rasht is in uh, the province Gilan in north of Iran, uh, in on the shore of Caspian uh, Sea. And um, Rasht has been, a, of course, a cultural center in Iran for a long time. And um, they um, uh, established cafe museum um, Rasht, which is. Um, um, cafe at the same time it has exhibitions uh, I think temporary exhibitions and uh, they uh, interview different uh, people uh, different uh, scholars uh, different researchers artists on different topics related to Iranian Persian culture and history and uh, they also kindly invited me to uh, go there and hold a speech one day they uh, also have uh, a journal, I think, it, or a newspaper, which is published for Cafe Museum uh, Ranch, which is, uh, uh, also shows, again, how active uh, both of them, Mr. Karimi and Mr. Murabullah, are for promoting Persian Iranian culture. And uh, this is uh, just one of, the, uh, one of uh, the areas where you can see how active Iranian uh, citizens are, and um, uh, in the area, in the area or realm of promoting history and culture of Iran. The Time Museum is also, as I uh, already have uh, another video on it. It's a very nice place, and um, having this interview in such a nice cafe was also something very, uh, very nice uh, for me. What uh, is also interesting is, is that um, during the interview uh, they ask me questions about uh, the state of uh, military museums of Iran. I'm, I'm just explaining that military museums of Iran have really precious items. I mean, we have now four of them. When I analyzed them for my first book, Arms and Armor from Iran, they were uh, three, now there are four and uh, they all uh, belong to the, um, the collection of Nasiruddin Shah of Rajah and he, they collected them through centuries and it's coming up from uh, at the end of the Timuri period and uh, many of them from Safari period and then Afsharid and then going to Zand and also Qajar period and they collected them there and uh, they were kept in the Danishkoya Afsadiyya, which was the military academy or university we ran in Pahlavi period. And uh, then uh, after the revolution of Iran, they were distributed to three museums, Museum of Sadabad, Military Museum of Sadabad, or Military Museum of Tehran, then um, Kakh Afifabad in Shiraz, Military Museum of Shiraz, and also Museum of Bandar Anzali, Military Museum of Bandar Anzali. Later, some items were collected, and then also some added from other areas, and then the military museum in Kerman um, was established. For quality, of course, the military museum of Tehran, Bandaran Zali, and the military museum of Shiraz um, are the best, of course. You can uh, you see uh, not only uh, Persian Iranian arms and armor, but also new um, state uh, presence. Of the new Really great uh, items from India, from Ottoman empires, from Ottoman Empire, and also European 
of sorts and arms and armor which were given as presents to the Persian and Iranian kings. And here you see Mr. Karimi as well and Mr. Farabola here in the background. And here you see Mr. Karimi is uh, opening my, he bought my last book, Persian Fire and Steel, and he is opening it and uh, uh, just browsing through it. So you can see something just my book, Persian uh, Fire and Steel. Um, I would like again uh, to thank both Mr. Karimi and Mr. Farabola. Looking forward to cooperation with uh, uh, Cafe Museum Rasht and also with these both gentlemen. Have a nice day.